guys, stickers arrived. Hello guys and welcome to a new studio vlog. We are back in my dining room, aka kitchen, because it just looks like a mess downstairs and I don't want to film downstairs anymore actually. As you saw in last week's video, the desk wasn't delivered and because the desk isn't delivered, I can't really continue with the renovation. It's supposed to come today. So let's see if it actually shows up. If the desk shows up today, we can um, buy the wooden slabs for the table and then I can finally move my computer around. So I hope that's gonna happen today. If that's the case, we might actually get the whole renovation done in this week's vlog. Fingers crossed. Guys, it happened. The table arrived, the base at least. So we're gonna set this up and then we're gonna go to the hardware store again to finally get a proper wooden slab so we can put it on top and i will have a new desk yay it's finally here so let's get the last couple of things done and i am ready to finally move all of this to my new desk Okay, at this point I think we bought everything we need, but I'm just having a look around and I found the craft area. It's not good, I'm seeing paint and I want it. Do I really need any of this? No, but the hardware store is really bad for me. It's kind of like when you go to a furniture store and you kind of want to buy everything. I get that in hardware stores as well. I don't even know what I want with all this stuff. I just want to have it. Okay, I got released from the hardware store nightmare and this is what we bought this is my desk or the slab for my desk and then i also bought like a little trash can for my bedroom uh, so it's just a bunch of small things and i couldn't help myself and I actually ended up buying some paint as well just like for drawing <laughs> i'm tired my foot hurts again but yeah let's go home and finish setting up the table Wollen wir den ähm, Dings noch äh, wegholen, bevor alles auf dem Tisch steht? current status on my studio desk is as you can see set up it's so cool and then we put this up this is where my printer will go and also my scanner we're gonna get rid of this desk in a second i need to make some space let's see how far we can get today honestly don't you say that it has to get worse before it gets better with stuff like renovation <laughs> this is the hallway again and this is a room currently and it's just getting worse look my stickers arrived these are the ones for the february pin club and it is bun bun is in france and look how cute it turned out so this is the exclusive sticker i think it's super adorable it's bun bun in front of the eiffel tower i don't know i really like this one now i'm only waiting for the postcards which should be arriving in a couple of days and then i'm just waiting for the pin and that one is kind of taking longer than expected so i hope it will be coming soon i feel like it's gonna be a little bit delayed so i might be a little bit late on the pin club but we see 
we see. But I think, can we focus on this? I think it's just focusing on my face. I'm sorry. It's really cute. So the rest of the renovation is going to happen today. And by the rest of the renovation, I mean we have one more wall that needs to get painted, but that will first happen in the afternoon. So right now we are actually driving to a furniture store and looking at a new office uh, desk. No, not desk, chair. I already have a desk, finally. We wanna look at some small decoration stuff. So let's go. Every time we look uh, for something from my studio, we actually end up buying stuff for everyone else in the house. So we found a table or a desk for my son's room so he can have his own computer upstairs so he doesn't have to sit in my studio anymore where he is currently. But yeah, haven't found a single office chair yet. All of these I don't really like, but this is a table my son is going to get and then i'm gonna try to find a chair for me so i'm not only trying to look for an office chair i also want to get one of those love seat chairs that are a little bit more comfy to just relax in something like this but bigger okay not gonna lie if i had a little bit more space downstairs i would get this one i just don't like the color but it looks comfy the worst part about finding anything is I don't really want anything that's black or dark colors. I want pastels and that's so hard to find. And I don't want white because of the dogs. And I just feel like white is just gonna get dirty so easily. I mean, pastels do too, <laughs> but I'm just gonna pretend they are better. So we came back to these ones. I don't know, they said they had so many chairs up here. There's no chairs, there's just sofas. Okay, I found some chairs, but they are all leather and I kind of don't want leather either. Maybe I'm too picky about this, I don't know. I'm just gonna get this one. It looks like I killed Bao Bao and made him into a chair. Beautiful. I just feel I'm in a point uh, in my life where I don't just wanna buy furniture to have furniture. Like, I feel you do that often in your early 20s, where you just get something for the sake of it. It needs to be cheap and you don't have a lot of money, so you just need stuff, right? But now I wanna go for a very specific style and it's so hard to find something that fits. The most dangerous area for my wallet. I like buying plastic flowers. I normally use them for product pictures, so I love buying them. Okay, the thing is, even for plastic flowers, I kind of don't want to buy them here because this one already costs seven euros. It's like just one of these branches. And I just know for like those plastic flowers, I can get them really cheap at Ikea. They are so cheap there. Okay, and we are at furniture store number two. I like this one. This furniture store is a lot better than the other one. There's a lot more neutral colors, light colors, a lot more pastels as well. I like it. I'm not sure if I like the price yet, but they have so much stuff that I actually enjoy compared to the other place we were at before. Okay, how do we like this one? I think it's really cozy. Maybe the green is a little bit too dark, but I really like it. Or maybe this one. Maybe this one. It is pink. It's kind of insane that I actually found a pink one. This one I really like from the colors too because it's a light blue. It looks a little bit weird through the camera, but it's really pretty in real life. I just don't like the size, it's way too big. And I really like this one. The only thing I don't like about it is um, that the back of it is solid. Not solid, it's hard. So you can't remove it. It's really cute though. This one is really cute. It's a rocking chair so far. It's really fun. Ooh. Hello guys, we are back from the furniture store and I put up the camera for the first time on my new desk. This is a place where I will film in the future. This will be the new backdrop, even though it looks like a mess right now. 
I hope it's gonna look really cute in the future. You can see a little bit of the yellow, and you have the pink, and even some of the blue. It looks really, really nice, so I like it a lot. As for the furniture store, the furniture store hunting went more or less good. I still haven't found an office chair. This seems to be like the biggest hurdle because I don't want to buy an office chair online, assemble it here, sit on it and find out it's not the right one for me because then I have to deassemble it and then send it back again. So I'm trying really hard to find a office chair that is in a furniture store near me so I can actually sit on it before buying it. But a lot of office chairs are obviously just black or gray and I really don't want that much black in this room anymore. I just want really bright colors or pastels. It's really, really hard to find. As you saw from the clips earlier, I got a little bit frustrated, I guess. We went to a second furniture store. And the funny thing is, I looked like a fucking trash goblin the whole time because I thought, oh, we're just gonna quickly go there and just go home again. I didn't think it would be like a whole three, four hours ordeal of us looking at furniture items. I actually did my makeup now in the evening. I don't know why. We went to a second furniture store and I actually found like one of those love seats that I really wanted. It's like those a little bit bigger than a normal chair. It's bigger than a normal chair. It's not a bed, it's not a sofa, it's somewhere in between. And I actually ended up buying this one. And I'm really happy with it. I put in a, what do you call it, a down payment so they could order it now. I would pay the rest once it arrives. But because it's custom made and I wanted a different kind of fabric, I didn't want the gray you saw in the picture. I actually wanted to go for a pink. They had to custom order it and it would take around 10 weeks until it arrives. So it will probably be the last furniture item arriving for this studio and the last piece I will put up. Yeah, we also painted the last wall. It's green now. I'm gonna show you guys in a second. Most of the hard work is done. There's still some hanging shelves that need to go he here behind me. And then we have some small things that need to be changed, but I think we are done with the most important things. I'm really happy I got my desk. That's the best part about this whole room, this desk. I'm gonna show you some close-ups in a second. For the evening, I have some emails I need to answer. I need to draw a little bit because I'm so behind on my March pin club. We already have the 11th and I haven't even shown the design for March yet. We also need to reorganize a few things in this room. I have a lot of drawers and if there's one thing I don't like is not being organized in them and I have the stuff that's really important to me close to me. And then I also need to prep some enamel pins that I'm sending to Offenbach am Main because I'm currently in a pop-up shop there. Every weekend they have the store open. So what I do is uh, if something sells out, I get the new pins ready again so they can be there for next weekend. So yes, I almost sold out of all of my pins. Um, so I need to get a new package ready. So I'm gonna do that tonight as well. Okay, let me show you guys my wall first of all. So here's the last wall and as you can see, it is green. It's a very, very light green. I didn't want it to go for anything that's too dark. If we do a turnaround, this is green. Then here is yellow all the way around to here. There's pink and blue. And this is what it's gonna look like in the future. In last week's vlog, we actually put the whole pin drawer over there on my storage. But I think we're gonna move it again because I kinda wanna have this standing right next to the door. This Kallax thingy is supposed to go next to it. So we later on have space underneath the window so my new chair can be put right there because that thing is huge. Oops, I totally forgot to film the things that I actually said I would film in my last clip. It's actually like two days later now already. I had major brain fog for the last couple of days. To be honest, I was not doing so well mentally. So I just decided to take some time off and not do any work at all. Well, I did, but I mostly did it offline. Oh my God, I just came home from my walk. Are you kidding me? Those are my throw blankets. Oh 
my god let's get these inside and it's a very interesting studio vlog after all <laughs> It's only 27 of these. I brought in two. Okay, they are heavy. A few more we can do. There's four, six. Six of them left. I'm gonna just get them in front of the door so they don't get wet. And then I take a break for half an hour and then I get the rest inside the house. I try to get them downstairs. Oh, okay, I look like a mess, but uh, I guess the vlog got a little bit more interesting towards the end. They're so heavy. I'm gonna go, guys. Have a nice day. Thanks for watching. Leave a comment. I appreciate it. Goodbye.